I love walking around pharmacies. I love doing that. I can't, I can't go to a pharmacy and not spend money. One of the products that creeps me out, they have a product at every pharmacy called KY Intense. <laughs> you seen the commercials for this thing? The commercial for, first of all, the commercial for KY Intense is super offensive, and we will talk about that. In the, first of all, if you've ever used KY Intense, you know that it's intense because it burns. <laughs> I will volunteer that. I accidentally used it one time thinking like, this is gonna be magical and it burned. And I promise you, girls don't want that. In my life, I've never been like, man, that sex was awesome. But you know what I wanted to feel like right after? Fire! <laughs> of course, they don't bill it as a burning sensation on TV. They call it a tingling sensation. And they try to like talk to the girls. They're like, ladies, do you want more pleasure out of your three minutes? Do you want that? Okay. <laughs> Well, KY Intense is great, because it's a tingling sensation for her, and he gets to use his penis, so everybody wins. <laughs> but even if, even if it was a tingling sensation, we live in a society preconditioned to not want tingling. We don't like tingling. We know that tingling, it means a bad thing is happening. Hey, everyone, Grandma says her arm is tingling. Oh, she must be having an orgasm. <laughs> You don't have to rush her to the hospital. She's laying on the ground with her eyes rolled back in her head. She's clearly enjoying herself. <laughs> Tingling. It's horrible. You ever hit your funny bone and been like, Pfft. oh. <laughs> the commercial is awful because it's two British people and they're sitting there having breakfast and they're discussing all the sex that they had the night before because they use the KY intense, but because the Brits are very tacit about sexual things, they're not coming right out and discussing it. They're speaking in code. And at the bottom of the screen are the subtitles in American. <laughs> so we can understand what they're saying. So they're sitting there and they're eating. They're having their porridge. <laughs> they're eating their curds and whey. <laughs> I don't care what the Brits eat. We won the war, so. Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> so they're sitting there and they're eating it. It's just very quiet and they're just... Teeth out to here. <laughs> the girl looks at the guy. Wonderful dessert last night, sire. She didn't say sire. <laughs> they don't talk like that anymore. So she talks and there's subtitles. Wonderful dessert last night. Hey, what'd you put on my puss? And then the guy. <laughs> Responds in kind. He's like, oh yes, twas twas a bit of a new recipe. Hoped you liked it. Put some of that K Y shit on my dick, bitch. How you like me now? <laughs> <laughs> and then the girl is like, oh yes, twas quite invigorating. Didn't expect that one. You fucking kidding me with that shit? What'd you put ants on your dick? Is this a joke? <laughs> you want to fucking die, motherfucker? You want to end up on snack? I'll fucking kill you. This fucking hurt. <laughs> then the guy. Like, oh yes, try to spin on an old recipe, try to dash up nutmeg. <laughs> and there were no subtitles for that because I think they fucking do use nutmeg and that's what makes it burn so much. 